वेलकम माई डियर स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ क्लास फाइव ए वेलकम टू माई जी के क्लास टूडे आई शैल इंट्रोड्यूस यू इंट्रोड्यूस यू सम स्पेशल प्रोवर्ब्स यू नो वट इज वॉट आर प्रोवर्ब्स प्रोवर्ब्स आर डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ स्पीचेस डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ यू नो ओल्ड कॉमेंट्स which are which once upon a time were done by some distinguished people educationists reformers of our society but uh, a proverb is a short well known pitty saying that is stating a general truth or piece of advice now you have to complete the following proverbs as i mentioned you know we are fond of beautiful proverbs i have fondness for beautiful proverbs now i now why do i have fondness for beautiful proverbs i have also fondness for beautiful proverbs because as a student of history uh i have read out many lives and achievements under different kings rulers educationists social reformers and of course social thinkers and philosophers of the world that's why i have seen some proverbs have moral value in our society some proverbs can give us moral lesson some proverbs can lead can lead us to a perfect life that's why it is my first and foremost duty to bring it to your notice why are proverbs important to our everyday life so some proverbs i shall discuss with you now you have to uh, fill in the blanks here it is i am telling you open at page number 33 open at page 33 i shall tell you one proverb now you have to fill in fill it well begun is dash done well begun well begun is dash done here it is you see it is a proverb but incomplete proverb because one uh, blank is there now you have to fill fill in one blank is there well begun is dash done now you have to fill in you have to fill in the blank with appropriate word now what should be there when begun is half done half done when begun is half done that means what we start what we start attentively is half done that's why it is our first and foremost duty to start our work efficiently so that the left portion which is left uh, the the rest of the portion the rest of portion which is left generally is done half that means it is meaningful well begun is dash done well begun is half done then what we what we begun what we begun perfectly is half done well begun is half done and next one united we stand as we fall united we stand dash we fall united we stand divided we fall united we stand divided we fall united we stand divided we fall that means unity is strength unity is strength whenever we shall uh, we shall be united we shall have strength 
and whenever we will be divided our strength automatically will be uh, uh, we have we do not have any strength whenever we will be divided there will be no unity and uh, no power no power will be there that means unity is power and disunity is uh, disunity is uh, powerless disunity means powerless unity means power unity means power disunity means powerless that means and next one think twice before you dash think twice before you act think twice before you dash think twice before you act and next one too many dash spoil the broth too many cooks spoil the broth too many cooks spoil the broth and next one slow and steady dash the race slow and steady dash the race slow and steady wins the race rome was not dash in a day rome was not built in a day rome was not built in a day and next one necessity is the mother of das necessity is the mother of das necessity is the mother of invention necessity is the mother of invention then next no das without pains no gains without pains no gains without pains and then never put up till das you can do today never put up till tomorrow what you can do today never put up till tomorrow when you gain today and then life is not a bed of das life is not a bed of roses life is not a bed of roses what is the meaning of it you know life is not a bed of roses that means in our life we have to struggle in our life we we must not take rest we must not see we must not lay down on the bed we must not take rest in our life our life is full of uh, full of uh, you know challenge so we have to face every day new new challenges that's why our life is not a bed of roses this proverb uh, is very meaningful and next one next one look before you leap look before you leap look before you dash look uh, you have to feel in uh, this way you have to fill fill this blank with this word look before you leap the next one honesty is the best das honesty is the best policy honesty is the best policy and health is das health is wealth health is wealth then das impression is the last impression first impression is the last impression das means first impression is the last impression and the next one face is the index of the das face is the index of the mind face is the index of the mind the next one first deserve then das desire first desire then desire first desire then desire every dog has a das every dog has a day every dog has a day the next one every cloud has a das every cloud has a silver lining every cloud has a silver lining silver lining the next one don't count your chickens before they das don't count your chicken before they hatched and diamonds cut das 
diamonds cut diamonds diamonds cut diamonds then next one barking dogs seldom dash barking dogs seldom bite barking dogs seldom bite a stay a stay a stitch in time save dash a stitch in time saves nine a stitch in time saves nine a friend in dash in is friend indeed a friend in dash is friend indeed a friend in need is friend indeed a friend in need is friend indeed as you sow so shall you reap as you sow so shall you reap the next one a bird in hand is worth two in the dash a bird in hand is worth two in the bush a bird in hand is worth two in the bush so these are the uh, important proverbs beautiful proverbs you have to learn properly so some blanks are there you have to fill in with appropriate word then it will become complete proverb and it looks very meaningful so uh, you have to learn it once again i repeat please uh, learn with me well begun is half done first proverb well begun is half done united we stand divided we fall united we stand divided we fall think twice before you act think twice before we act too many dash too many cooks spoil the broth too many cooks spoil the broth slow and steady wins the race slow and steady wins the race rome was not built in a day rome was not built in a day necessity is the mother of invention necessity is the mother of invention no gains without pains no gains without pains never put up till tomorrow you can do today never put up till tomorrow you can what you can do today life is not a bed of roses life is not a bed of roses look before you leap look before you leap the next one honesty is the best policy honesty is the best policy health is well health is well and uh, first impression is the last impression first impression is the last impression then face is the index of the mind face is the index of the mind the next first deserve then desire first deserve then desire and every dog has a day every dog has a day then every cloud has a silver lining every cloud has a silver lining then don't count your chickens before they hatched don't count your chickens before they hatched diamonds cut diamonds diamonds cut diamonds the next one barking dogs seldom bite barking dogs seldom bite the next one a stitch in times a stitch in time saves nine a stitch in time saves nine a stitch in time saves nine a friend in need is friend indeed a friend in need is friend indeed then as you sow so shall you reap as you sow so shall you reap the next a bird in hand is what to in the bush a bird in hand is or to in the bush a bird in hand is or to in the bush is or to in the bush a bird in hand is or to in the bush so these are the my dear these are the proverbs my dear students you have to learn properly you learn properly automatically you will have complete idea about the meaning about its uh, uh, you know uh, uh, 
about its usefulness, everything you will be able to learn proper, prominently. But you have to learn it properly. Learn properly. Thank you.